Welcome back to High School Game Night's preseason special, and it wouldn't be complete without some predictions, so we're joined by the voice of Blue Ridge football, Eric May. Thanks for taking the time, Eric. Yeah, my pleasure. Glad to be here. All right, so let's look at Section 1. How do you think Warwick rebounds from a rough year, and with Lancaster Catholic coming in, can anyone dethrone Wilson at the top? Well, as far as Warwick is concerned, you know, you look at what they have coming back, and I think the strength of their team is going to be up front. Um, Zach Hurst is the quarterback. He experienced injury as pretty much all Warwick quarterbacks last year. If you can keep him healthy, I think there's going to be good things in Lidditz. Uh, as far as Wilson is concerned, you know, every year this team is always near the top. Of course, they've got 90-some kids in uniform. That helps. Having Lancaster Catholic in Section 1 is really going to make the section very interesting. I think Section 1 is going to be a, a dogfight all year long. All right, and it should be a wild season in Section 2. Lampeter Strasburg has taken the last two section titles, but who has the firepower this year to deny, to deny them the three-peat? Well, I think you look at LS, and the first thing you look at is the, the skilled players that were lost to graduation. That's hard to replace when you lose that many guys. Granted, you have the guys up front, which can definitely help, but I think Manheim Central and Cacalico are going to be the top two teams there in Section 2 this year. Both have... Uh, returning players, they've got not only returners up front, but skill players as well. Uh, look for the Eagles and Barons to do battle again towards the end of the year. Oh, can't wait. And finally in Section 3, Garden Spot joins the party dealing with some major losses. But is there enough talent left for the Spartans to make some noise there in the lower section? Well, I, I think so. Uh, I think the move down wasn't really embraced by, by the kids, but at the same time they look at it as a new challenge. and. Uh, uh, I think it's something that they're going to they're gonna embrace. Um, how soon they adjust to it, though, and of course, keeping everybody healthy is going to be key for Garden Spot. But I think Donegal and Columbia are two teams to look out for in Section 3. All right. Thanks so much, Eric. We appreciate it. And remember, we do have this on tape, so we'll have to see if your predictions hold up. <laughs> okay, don't hold me to it, though. Well, we promise to be nice, Eric. And don't forget, you can hear from Eric May again this coming Friday on opening night. Our game of the week is at Mayheim Central as backyard rivals Warwick journey to Baron Nation. Eric will have the call from the booth with former Conestoga Valley head coach Jerry Novak. Should be quite a rivalry game to open up the season. Our coverage begins at 7 p.m. this coming Friday night as the high school football season kicks off.